My name is David Watts and I'm here with Tom Boucher from Emulex and today we're going to talk about the two Emulex fibre channel adapters. We've got the 8 gig fibre channel adapter and the 16 gig adapter for System X servers. So Tom, um, these two adapters, um, what's new, with, new and interesting about these? Well, we've had the 8 gig now for quite a while so really it's more just that it's supported on the new platform and it's around still. The 16 gig is really where most of the excitement's at for the new Grantly launch. Uh, we've added two new features to the 16 gig fabric that uh, one's called ClearLink and one is called ExpressLink and they add some new capabilities when combined with a brocade fiber channel switch that IBM sells to give you some enhanced capabilities on these new adapters. Um, and where would customers see value in, the, in these new features? So Clear, ClearLink, what it's used for is more of a cable diagnostic. You know, in the past we've been able to do a loop back to see if the adapter's okay, but you really couldn't test the path between the adapter, the switch, and then the switch and the storage. And what ClearLink gives you now is the capability to run loop back from the adapter across the cable to the switch port to make sure that everything's fine between the switch and the adapter. And then the switch can send signals from its side down to the card or down to the storage target as well. So it gives you a lot more capability for finding out issues. The express lane, uh, with the advent of SSD uh, storage targets, you have a fabric now that could have both SSD targets and uh, spinning disk targets. And spinning disks are obviously going to be slower than SSD, and the adapter doesn't know which one's faster and which one's slow. So in a standard fiber channel network, you have a certain number of buffer credits available. But if the spinning disk is taking longer to complete than the SSD, with an 8-gig network, you have SSD drives slowing down because the storage spinning disks have to catch up. What Express Lane lets you do is on the switch and on the adapter specify what's an SSD type storage target and then what's a disk storage target. And then after that information is provided, the adapter and the switch give more buffers to the SSD target and then give less to the spinning disk target because the SSD is going to complete mm. faster and it gives it better so performance. So Express Lane's particularly aimed at customers to have a mix of SSDs and spinning drives, right? Is that right? Correct. correct. Yeah, okay. And you said that these uh, use brocade switches? Yes, so you do need a, both an Emulex adapter and a brocade switch currently to take advantage of it. Other vendors may add it at a later time, but right now brocade and Emulex are kind of leading the way with that technology. Okay, okay, and um, what operating systems are uh, uh, supported with the, these features? Well, the nice part about this is it's OS independent, so it doesn't okay. matter. The, the OSs just load the standard fiber channel driver just like before. This, when you set up the management of your fiber channel switch and the adapter, you turn on the features inside the cards and they handle it separate from the operating system. All right, all right, so operating system independent feature works with the brocades. So that those features are new just on the on the 16 gig yes. adapter. So right? it was a the, the card has been shipping for a while now, but it was a new software update that came right. and coincided with the Grantly launch that right. added those two new capabilities to the 16. And, gig. But both adapters work on the new service like this, Absolutely. like the 3550 M5 we have here and the 3650 M5 we just yes. announced. They are still PCI Gen 2, but the, even with the new Gen 3 cards, they're fully backward compatible with these. Right. There wasn't really a requirement to go Gen 3 with these platforms. So we kept them as they were. And the, the 16 gig adapter also supports 8 gig fabrics, right? Yes, it's one of the features of 16 gig, aside from the faster bandwidth, is that with the newer generation ASIC on these cards, it's almost twice as fast even on an 8 gig network. So if you have an 8 gig storage target, but you have a brocade switch that's 16 gig, and our adapter that's 16 gig, you can see almost twice the performance of the previous generation card. Mm. So there may be some benefits to going to 16 gig even if you don't have a 16 gig storage target yet. So if you're still, if you're using 8 gig fabric, there are there are performance benefits even upgrading just to the yes. 16 gig card. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Plus the new new features that are just coming. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, very good. Well, so here we have the Emulex 16 gig and 8 gig fiber channel adapters. Uh, for SystemX servers. I hope you found the video useful and we'll see you later.